Du bist vegan? Ja. Pech gehabt. Du wirst nie so aufgepumpt wie ich sein, weil du blass und schwach bist von Fleischmangel. Du brauchst Fleisch für Eisen, damit du Eisen stimmen kannst. from Bite Size Vegan and welcome to another vegan nugget. One of the most common stereotypes we vegans come up against is that of the weak, pale, iron deficient, anemic vegan. Dietary iron is strongly associated with meat consumption, particularly red meat, meaning the flesh of cows, pigs, lambs, and other animals. So what's a vegan to do when it comes to getting adequate iron levels? This is the fourth video in my nutrient series with nutrition powerhouse Dr. Michael Greger of nutritionfacts.org. So far we've covered protein, omega fatty acids, and calcium. And now, let's hear from Dr. Greger on the matter of iron in a plant-based diet. The next nutrient that people worry about going vegan, and I think a lot of times because we associate this one with meat consumption, is iron. Yeah, iron so people eating plant-based get more iron too, but it's the right type of iron. It's non-heme iron. So the blood and uh, so the iron in blood and muscles. Um, so-called heme iron um, is absorbed whether we need it or not. And uh, iron is a double-edged sword. Um, it uh, actually acts as a pro-oxidant and too much of it can increase our risk for liver damage and diabetes and heart disease and all sorts of bad things. Not having enough of it though, we can't make enough blood cell, um, red blood cells, we can become anemic. And so our intestine um, when we don't have enough uh, iron, absorbs more, and we have too much iron, it absorbs less. So it's perfect, keeps us right where we need to be, but that's only with non-heme iron. I mean, that's the iron that we've evolved for at least the first 23 out of 25 million years of our evolution, is almost all plant sources. And so our bodies know how to regulate that. But heme iron slips through our intestine whether we have too much of it or not, so particularly with men, um, uh, maybe getting, uh, uh, actually risking too high, too much iron um, and causing extra, extra oxidative stress. Women are less likely to suffer because they have, uh, uh, at least uh, during reproductive age, have, uh, you know, monthly uh, blood loss and so can keep uh, uh, iron levels from getting too high. Um, uh, but, uh, so look, we need iron. Um, one in 20 menstruating women have iron deficiency anemia, and that's the same for vegans and omnivores or vegetarians. Vegans don't have higher rates, um, but one in 20 is a pretty bad rate, period, and so we need to get good sources of iron. Where do we get it? Beans and greens. How many times have you heard me say that? Beans and greens. We've got to eat our beans and greens. Also, dried fruits, um, uh, you know, good source to uh, get some of these minerals as well. I hope you enjoyed hearing from Dr. Greger on this topic. As he pointed out, there are plenty of vegan sources of iron, beans and greens being excellent examples. And in fact, these are even better iron sources on a per calorie basis than meat. For example, you would have to eat more than 1,700 calories of sirloin steak to get the same amount of iron found in 100 calories of cooked spinach. One of the great advantages of a vegan diet is that it's high in vitamin C, which acts to markedly increase the absorption of non-heme iron by about six-fold when eaten in combination with iron-containing foods. With many vegan foods, you get a double whammy of naturally co-occurring iron and vitamin C, such as in broccoli and bok choy. In addition to beans and greens, some other vegan iron sources include breads, cereals, and grains, quinoa, oatmeal, prune juice, dried apricots, dried figs, raisins, raw or cooked mushrooms, baked potato, tofu, lentils, sunflower seeds, and cashews. And just a safety note, as with animal-based heme iron, iron supplements can become toxic if you take too much. So if you are going to supplement, please do so under the care of a physician and get your levels checked regularly. But if you're just eating a whole foods, plant-based diet, you'll be getting all of the iron you need and your body won't absorb any excess. It's interesting how many health and nutrition issues you don't have to worry about or manage when you're not eating animals and their byproducts. It's almost like our biology and physiology are telling us that we weren't meant to eat them at all. So here is my iron intake from yesterday, the bulk of which came from lettuce and butternut squash. It's all non-heme iron, so no worries about overdoing it. 
If you want to track your own iron intake, check out Chronometer to track your nutrition and activity. It's totally free and an incredibly useful resource. As if that's not enough awesome, they're actually sponsoring this video to help get this vital information out to you. Be sure to click the link in the video description or the info card sidebar to go make your profile so they know that Bite Size Vegan sent you and that we vegans can pump some serious dietary iron. Oh wait, I already used that wordplay in the opener. Maybe I could say something ironic. Let's just move along. If you enjoyed this mega dose of vegan iron, give the video a big thumbs up and share it around to spread the nutritional truth. If you're new here, be sure to hit that big red subscribe button down there for more awesome vegan content every Monday, Wednesday, and some Fridays. And to not miss out on the rest of the videos with Dr. Greger. If you want to help keep Bite Size Vegan educating, check out either of the support links in the video description below. And for perks and rewards for your support, like early access to all my videos, just click the Nugget Army icon right there or the link in the info card sidebar for more info on joining up and hey check out some of my related videos while you're here now go live vegan pump your dietary iron and I'll see you soon oh ich bin so gepumpt oh ich bin die beste ich bin die beste weil ich fleisch esse this one arm's really sore now because I've just been curling with this arm and not this arm I'm so out of shape <laughs>